Rock Python. Rock Python. Okay, Monday, Tuesday. Monday, Tuesday. I think I still don't like. So. Huh? So. Uh, see you Ah, see you on the My name is Mtala The Voice. So today we are going to the Nairobi National Museum Park that is a snake park to see vipers, to see snakes, to see serpents. Someone told me that humans are snakes. So today we are getting inside there so that we can see, you know, I just want to have that adrenaline, you know. I don't like snakes, personally. I don't like snakes, totally. I don't like snakes, especially being in contact with me. And not only snakes, I don't like reptiles. I know there are so many people like me here, maybe people with different opinion, but we are getting inside here. So we're going to the Nairobi National Museum, museum located here in Nairobi, Kenya, Africa, and straight to the snack park. So let's go. So here we are at Museum Nairobi National Museum where we have got the snack park inside here, just next to that is expressway, that is a Waiyaki way, and um, beautiful road. So Let's get inside and see. So now we are headed to the snack park, you know, mostly about me personally. I'm not a big fan of reptiles and to be specific, snakes. I'm not a good fan of snakes. That one is for sure, for sure. It's not like I fear them. It's just like, um, I just want to be sincere. I know some people are going to have a different opinion about this. I don't fear them, but I just don't like them. So when you don't have an understanding about something you you know you want to really know wh what is this about snakes that's why i'm here today i just want to understand what is this about snakes so it's not like i'm coming to conquer my fear i just don't like them like so many people watching this i know there's so many people maybe who cannot say like this because you know hey we animal lovers you know you're not supposed to say that but i'm just genuine i don't like snakes but I don't fear them, but I just want to go and experience them today. So I've been told uh, it is in this building, the snack park here in Kenya, Nairobi, Africa, East Africa. So I'm hoping to see different varieties of snacks. So I need to be careful. Maybe they're in these trees and I don't know. <laughs> so man, let's go. My name is Mtala The Voice, man. Welcome to the channel, man. So I do travel videos and Kenya is my home country. So I saw it good, man, to show you around my home country and also so that when you come to Kenya, you get to experience different things about this country. So let's get inside and see what we have here today. So here is the entrance, I think so. So I will consult here then see what where to go. So here we go, here we go, let's see. So it's being checked, the receipt. So I, I paid 300 shillings, which converts to three dollars. So that is for if you are if you are a citizen, a Kenyan citizen. So the prices are different, of which I'm going to show you later. Uh, you know, uh, if you're going only for the museum, you pay 200 Kenyan shillings. If you're coming to the snacks park only, you pay also 200 shillings. But if you're paying double it uh, for the snack park and the museum, now you pay 300 Kenyan shillings, which converts to. Um, Three dollars. So I think inside there. So I'm waiting for it to be stumbling to the serum. So here we are. Man. Different types of snakes. Which one is this one? Kenya sunbow. Wow, there it is. Can you be able to see it? It's not moving. Man. I want to see it moving. Wow, they are like. Uh, two or three of them so here it is more information about this one and it smells it smells bad what about this one is a rufus big big snake is it like it's so moving look <laughs> what are you doing what are you doing Mm -hmm. uh, 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 so what is called a uh, roof is big snake. Alright. Uh, uh, Alright. Uh, I smell to the next one. 
and they're not moving and they're alive. These are brown house snake, medium size, fair skin. And there's so many of them. Why are they not moving? Is it consumer mm. coin? Mm. Mona is a song. I'm going to come to the song. I'm going to come to the song. I'm going to come to the song. I'm going to come Green snake. Oh, but oh, this one looks more blue than green. Oh, my mina, I'm going to be on. Eh, pull up blue, pull up red, green. Yeah. It's called green snake, but I think it looks more blue than green. Ah, it's moving now. At least I've seen a, a moving snake now. Venomous lizard, dart, lizard, chameleons, mammals, hyvas. Okay. Good. Anyway. Now, let's move, 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 move. What are we having here? Uh, these are lizards. Uh, these are chameleons. Hey, it has got a lot of flies here. I think it, it smells so bad. I think they smell so bad, that's why there is a lot of flies inside here. Wow. Whoa. Now, uh, Gabon Viper, beaches. This is a viper, now this is a snake. Wow. This big, this big. This is poisonous. <laughs> yeah, I can feel, I can see the eyes. Is this poisonous? Okay, broad head, backbone, habitat, venom, a good nature animal that, are, that rarely bites. Okay, however, bite will be a major medical emergency. Yeah. Wow, this is venomous. They're not moving, man. They're like really tired. <laughs> wow. So, so this one. If um, I was not told which uh, which one is this, I could have thought maybe it is a. Uh, it is a python, but it's not a python. It is a, it is a Gabon viper. So, I don't see. What are we having here? What are we having here? I don't see anything. Looks like here. Uh, the Kenyan bush viper. Let me turn my camera. I don't see this now. Ah, here it is, man. Here it is. I was wondering where it is. Man. There are two of them. I can see two of them. They have camouflaged with this, you know. Uh, is it grass or something like that? Wow, so they sound really good. Hey. Guys! Wow. Yeah! <laughs> I can see there. There's another snake inside here. What's the name of this one? There's turtles there. Let me zoom. Can you be able to see those turtles there? Wow. Mom, I remember thinking I could I can see even on top of trees. Can you be able to see? Can you be able to see that? Yeah. Can you be able to see that? Wow, 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 you, you need to be careful, man. You need to be really, really careful. Actually, I, 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 don't, I don't like snakes. I don't like snakes. So, I'll give you a story about, you know, why I'm saying so. There's so many of them. There's so many of them in those trees. Even, I think what I can be able to see, there are like uh, more than 10. That's what I can be able to see. I don't know what I'm unable to see because they have camouflaged in, the, in that tree. I take for example, uh, let me zoom, let me zoom so that you get to see. Can you be able to see? Like, you see, there. Okay, another one. Uh, you see, there. Have you, can you be able to see from my hand? That one there. All right, even there, there's so many of them, man. There's so many of them, they have camouflaged like uh, you cannot see them properly so let's keep moving let's keep moving 
So, let me give you a story about uh, why I don't like um, uh, I don't like snacks. I think it is um, it is something like uh, how we grew up back in the village. Like we were trained, when you see a snake, you kill it. So on uh, the only thing I know about snakes, when I see, I kill it. So when you are able to kill something, it's not like you fear it, but you just don't like it. So with time, you come to understand more about snakes. You come to understand more about nature. You know, but still, I'm not a good fan of uh, reptiles. That one for sure. I cannot hide it from you. I'm not a good fan of reptiles. I know some of you maybe are used to that environment with us where we grew up. Um, is like we know we have to appreciate nature. There's something I want to show you here. There is something. Is it? Uh, I don't know the name. I'll tell you. There's something interesting there. So it is uh, like uh, where we grew up. We don't like reptiles and amphibians like totally for sure most people of my age even with my forefathers my uncles when we see them back then in the village we never used to tolerate them so that's how I grew up that's where I grew up that was my environment that's why I don't like snacks so let me show you something interesting here so this is a monitor lizard actually uh, in my village they call them embulu Embulu. So these ones we don't like them at all because they eat our chickens. And you know people from Western Kenya with their chickens, you know, you don't separate them with their chickens. So when you used to see them, you just kill it. We never used to entertain monitor lizards. So now you understand why from my village uh, or people from my area actually don't like snakes because we lived a village life. And even this monitor lizard, we never liked them. Ah, more snakes here. What is this type of snake? This is a puff adder. Can you see them? There's so many of them inside them. Are puff adders actually uh, venomous? Let me see. They are, I am the most dangerous snake in Africa. Oh, puff adder is the most dangerous snake. Can you be able to see them? I need to be careful. I know, you know, I don't trust. I have good trust issues. Eh? I don't trust everything. Maybe you would see another one there. They're venomous. So I don't know. I, I'm looking my left, right, center. Uh, I just don't. But they smell bad. They smell bad. They smell really bad. I don't like the smell. So these things have camouflaged in, the, you know, uh, in those stones. Sometimes you can, you know, you cannot see them. But there's so many of them inside here. You can see more than ten. Wow, so let's go. So what's your belief about stone, uh, I mean snacks from your community? I know you're watching this from different parts of the world and uh, maybe Africa, Asia, Europe, America. Yeah, so tell me what you understand or what is your belief about snacks from your community, wherever you're watching this from. Because with me, I'm not good with snacks. I don't like them. Just, I'm very sincere with that. I'm very sincere with that. So don't judge me a lot because of that. I'm very sincere with that. So let me show you the next snake. It's very big actually. So let me show you. So here it is. Man, what is this? This African rock python. Wow. Wow. So there's the African rock python. Ah, there's so many of them inside here, man. So can you find, so this is how it looks like in here. I don't like snakes. I think they look ugly. Maybe someone is watching this and wants to say, Tala, that's so bad, you're not supposed to say that. But me, I find uh, snakes very mysterious, very ugly. I'm just genuine. I'm just genuine. So, you know, maybe you have got a different opinion. That's just my opinion. There's another one there. And they smell so bad. I don't like the smell. They smell so bad. Do smells smell bad or is it this water here that smells like that? Man. Wow, wow, wow. But these ones are very humongous when they're in a big size. So they are. Look how shiny their skin is. Can you be able to feel how shiny it is? Or is it from, you know, when you see them with naked eyes now, that's where you can find their glow when, you know, we have that sunshine, you know, uh, on them. Wow, 
Let's nice go, let's go. So you go to this one, the red spitting cobra. Ah, red spitting cobra. I cheese man. So your venom, new neurotoxic and cytotoxic venom in the eye is the most common result of an encounter with this snake. So it's surprised that can you be able to see that? Now we move to the next one. Which one is this? Egyptian cobra. Naja Haji. So this is what we see with the you know Egyptian <laughs> mummies, Egyptian, you know, uh, pharaoh or pharaohs. So here it is. Let me know. This one this one is poisonous. A potent neurotoxic causing flaccid paralysis. Vibes must be treated as some medical emergency. Wow. We move to the next one. This is called the forest cobra, Naja melanoluk, hey, neurotoxic venom. Hey, this one is shining. This one looks just dangerous. I've seen this one in my home village. Huh? They are common, this type of cobras. The ones shining like this. And all my villagers have killed so many of them <laughs> that I'm very sure about. Hey, man, this is crazy. Hey, what about this? There's no information about this one. Is it a cobra also? It's resting there. Can you be able to see that? Hey, man. All these are types of cobras. What type of cobra is this? It's a brown spitting cobra. Ah, it is a brown spitting cobra. Look at the head. It looks like this. <laughs> This thing is where uh, they live a very boring uh, life just inside here. I hope they do remove and bring other ones so that they don't stay here like forever. Black naked spitting cobra. Man, there it is. Oh, this one's when you don't joke with them. One is here. Another one is there, shining. Shining. Shining bright like a diamond. What type of uh, African rock python? This is a python, rock pythons. Can I be able to see that? <laughs> wow, wow. Green mamba, these are common to Kenyans. Hey, man, it's shining luminous. It's not even green, this is luminous, man. <laughs> wow. Wow, 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 There is a turtle here. Is it a turtle or a, or a, or a, or a, is this, no, it's not a turtle. Is it a turtle or a, forgotten the name, forgotten the name. I was trying to say a tortoise, not a turtle. Is it a tortoise? You can see it there. You may be able to see them. There's so many of them inside there, but uh, you can there go inside there because there is a there is a lot, a lot, a lot of a lot of uh, snakes inside here. So you need to be careful when you come here. So let me show you something more, another interesting thing. This is a crocodile. I want to show you. Let me show you. So there is a crocodile here. That's why you can see there is water there. They like water also. They come out basking in this sunshine. Ah, there's a bigger one. Let me show you a bigger one. So there's a bigger, there's a bigger American alligator. Oh, this is an alligator, it's not a crocodile. Wow. This can maul you like crazy. This is an alligator. This is an alligator. Man. Wow. Look at it. Look at it. Wow, wow, wow. And it, it smells. It's got this smell. Oh, there's another. Uh, another. There's a uh, crocodile. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. So, let me go like this. So, if they see if uh, there is something else to to learn about this place. 
Wow. So far, how do you find this space? How do you find this space? See more uh, crocodiles this side. Can you be able to see in that far distance? Wow. Tortoise. Wow. But you need to be careful when you're here because I think uh, snakes can sneak out. I think so. Because like this place, if you an open area, then there are snakes on the trees. So convince me how they cannot sneak to you know these other sides. Let me show you a tortoise. Or tortoises. So many of them. You see how they're eating, man. These are tortoises, man. All these, man. Tortoise. All of them. All these. Wow. Wow. Different sizes. Uh, I think they're of different ages. These things live, live for a lot of years, man. That one I'm very sure about. They live for so many years. Look at this one. Wow, so let's go. You can see there is a snake moving here, man. It's so long. Is it like uh, two or three meters? Maybe we would see it. Let me see. Is it venomous? Uh, both neurotoxic, cardiotoxic, causing paralysis. Oh man, this is crazy, man. This one, you don't joke with it. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. And many of them. On this side, you'll be able to see it. So this one you don't joke with them, they're venomous. Most of the snacks here are venomous. Uh-huh. What about this one? This is called the Jensen's Mamba. So this is the Jensen's Mamba. Wow. Man. Venom. Highly neurotoxic venom. Whoa. You don't joke with them. So, let's go. So, we are moving from this next side now to the aquarium or aquarium, depends on how you want to pronounce it. So, this is aquarium inside here. So, let's see what you've got here inside the aquarium. So, there is this silver catfish. Here it is. Then what are this Nile tilapia? They look like this. They don't look like tilapia. Uh, there is a. Uh, it's called guppies. Very small. Uh, this is a red eye uh, labeo. Move closer. Wow. There is a label babas. I don't see them. Oh, can you be able to see them? I'll go to the next one. This is Sabaki tilapia. Sabaki tilapia. These are like Kenyan fishes. We move closer. You will see this. And uh, we go to the Dwarf Victoria mouth, uh, mouth brooder. Oh. Mouth brooders. Look at it. And uh, what are we having here? Common catfish. Yay. Yay, this stuff. The catfish. Fish. Or mud fish. It depends on what you want to call them. Is it either mud fish or catfish? No. Moving, moving, and moving nice. These are just art, art, art stuffs and what can be found in the sea. So, uh, seashells, let me show you. Seashells, corals, rocks, uh, things that are found in the sea and uh, the water bodies in Kenya. All this. All this. There is a story about mummies. It's a very story, a very common story about the coastal people of Kenya. So, tell me in the comment section in your home country, do you believe in uh, the mummy things or story folk tales about that? I need to know. 
All right, now there's uh, there more aquariums here. Let's see what we got inside here. So I don't see any fish inside here. But let's see it. Let's see. What is this? The zebra moray. Mm -hmm. I don't see any fish here. No fish here. Oh, I can see starfish. Uh, what are this? This blue one is a well known starfish. But there is another kind of fish inside there. There is a tube one. Where is that tube? Ah, there it is. This is not a tube one. It's something different. Uh, firefish. Oh, it's not fire. Oh, I can see a firefish. But this blue one, I want to know. So there's a firefish. But don't it look like that? I don't see it. Uh, <laughs> I think he yeah, is just random fishes. I don't see. Is this a firefish? I need to know. Look at it, it's so beautiful. It's a very beautiful fish. About this um, habitat, Sabaki Chilapi, you have seen this one. So let's go, 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 let's go. There are more fishes here. These are the African lungfish. African lungfish. Is it alive? It's so moving. <laughs> Oh, and uh, we've got a uh, oh man, European eel. <laughs> Looks like a snake. Look at it. <laughs> it looks dangerous. Look at it, man. Oh, it's right, so looks like that. Wow. That was the aquarium side, so I'm leaving the aquarium right now, so let's see what you have here today. Oh. So huh? <laughs> Someone. Uh -huh. Let me put it down so let me need. So eating your gagari? What what is the name of this snake? Huh? What is the name of this snake? Uh Loco Python. Rock python. Rock python. Yeah. 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 I think I still don't like. <laughs> uh, yeah. I've never been this. I've never touched a snake. Never to Songa even. Eh? Songa even. Yeah. 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 So is this the, the the final size or can it be bigger like this than this? Yeah, and there's a quite cool. Oh, right. Ten meters. It can be more than ten meters. Mm. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> so, so, sad. Thank you. <laughs> it it goes, uh... <laughs> Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't you have other snakes here? I'm a... Oh, okay. I have no other snakes. You can see here. Uh, oh. <laughs> so here it is, man. So there is a rock python. We move closer so that I can be able to show people how it is. what is going on there <laughs> man that's all about the snake park here in Nairobi Kenya National Museum here um, the snake park section so <laughs> 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 
So that's the rock pipe. Let me show you again. So if you want, uh, <laughs> that's it. <laughs> <laughs> There's so many people who don't like snakes, okay. Wow. So that is this. <laughs> Alright man. So far how do you find it? That was my experience. Um, that was my first time, you know, putting a snake on my shoulder or on my neck or something close to that or being in contact, direct contact with the snake. All right, I already told you uh, in the beginning of the video is like um, I'm not a very good fan of reptiles, that is snakes, amphibians, or reptiles, any kind of reptiles. I'm not good with that. So, but uh, it, it has been a day that uh, I've been able to interact with some of them. So, after this, I'm going to show you the prices if you want to come inside there. Then we wrap up the day. So, let's go. My name is Antar the Voice. So, there is a place here, uh, maybe if you want to chill, I think if you want to have a drink or something, you can come here, they have a, a restaurant here. So let me see, the Museum Heritage Restaurant, it is an Indian, continental, Chinese, barbecue, Kenyan cuisine. So if you want, you can come here, have some good time. Yeah, so it was just behind there, if you want to, you know, have some meal here at uh, you know at the museum that's where you're going to enjoy your meal so let's keep going so let me show you the prices here these are the charges um okay for citizens uh you pay 200 shillings that's for an adult if you want to combine ticket for the national museum and uh, the snack pack you pay 300 but if you're paying differently uh, differently you want to go to the you know uh, to the museum 200 to the snack pack 200 for children it is uh, 100 100 then 150 for combined tickets residents from the east african community you know it is um, adult is 600 um, that is for the museum then 400 for the snack pack then 600 for the combined ticket below the age of 16 it's 400 for the museum 200 for the snack pack and 300 uh, for the combined ticket then non-residents uh, those not from the east african community of an adult it is uh, 1200 which converts to um, um, which converts to uh, 12 dollars and uh, for the snake pack also uh, $12 for the combined tickets it's $15 for children it's $6 $6 or combined one you pay $10 so it's open daily from 8:30 a.m. to 5:30 p.m. so including weekends and public holidays so if you want to come so what if you want to do the conversion now to the Kenyan shillings you just do it for 200 is uh, equivalent to $2 100 is equivalent to uh, one dollar six hundred is equivalent to six dollars so at least you know so some rules here you need to come with your passport or maybe if you're a citizen you come with your ID something to identify you so yes that's all about the National Museum and also the snack park so that was my day here man it was really wonderful at the museum Museum, the snake park and the museum there's so many things man I've learned that even personally I am a citizen here but uh, maybe I I didn't know about this place so you can come if you want to learn about the African heritage something to learn about Africa now this is the right place to learn here at Nairobi National Museum located in Nairobi East Africa Africa all right that was it man I really appreciate for your time watching and supporting me every time and that's it. My name is Mutal Voice. Have a good time.